Hello, I'm Mark Ray. I'm a professor at the Lighting Research Center at Rensselaer Polytechnic Institute. I'm also the principal investigator of a project funded by NIOSH looking at the future of barricade lights. Workers in road construction zones are at a higher risk of injury or fatality than any other worker. Flashing warning lights are often their only defense from nearby traffic. This project was aimed at identifying those characteristics of warning lights that maximize worker safety. Standard barricade lights flash randomly, causing confusion and glare. The barricade lights that the LRC developed dim at night to prevent glare and can flash in sequence to guide drivers through a work zone. They can flash high to low instead of high to off to improve guidance for the driver. They adjust to the right level to maintain visibility during the day. A wireless device is used to control these settings. And also flash synchronization. Flash frequency. Flash direction, for example, west to east or east to west. Any flash order and to stay lighted. Through built-in GPS and a mesh network, the system knows the position of all the barricade lights. If the lights are moved or a new one is added, the flash sequence updates automatically. 